now we start scanning of lower abdomen area of female here we see the gases in the get loops this is urinary bladder which is partially filled the walls of urinary bladders are appears to be normal and echogenic as thin line the urine is anequic and no debris seen posterior to the urinary bladder we see the uterus the endometrium is thin lined and normal here we see the solicystic area in the posterior wall of the uterus which is left ovary and appears to be normal no pathology seen now we will scan the right adenexa or right ovary as urinary bladder is partially filled so there is difficulty in scanning the pelvic area these are small gut loops containing gases and food particles in right adenexa we see well defined hypoechoic area which is appear as cyst but we see another hypoechoic area which continues with this cyst it appear as two cysts lies parallel to each other patient is feeling severe pain at this area now when we rotating the probe at its axis we see that these two sheets are interconnecting with each other and appear as tubular structure if we focus around the cyst here we see this cyst is connecting with the uterus now we trying to find out the right ovary it is lying anterior to the uterus and appears to be normal in size and texture
so this cystic tubular structure is attached with one side from ovary and other sides with uterus and here has dilated fallopian tube filled with an aqueic fluid no free fluid seen in the pelvis around the uterus or ovaries so patient is feeling pain due to dilated right fallopian tube Now how we will write report 